Hey there everybody, how you doing? I am Francis and welcome back to the Legend of the Dreambinder. In the last episode, we wandered through two caves and we have finally reached the other side of the wasteland where we found the Gossip Keep. Is there a piece of the Dreambinder here? Well, we're going to go find out, won't we? So let's get going. Oh boy! Oh boy, that's a lot of skeletons. Okay, skeletons can take a while to defeat, um... Sure, I'll try and defeat them. I got Dragon Blow. You want to take care of the guy in the back because he can attack twice. And... Yeah, we're just going to focus all our strength on the guy in the back. Because he can be annoying. And let's use Angel's Kiss. So we have uh, HP regain. Alright, he's gone. He's not a problem anymore. Oh yeah, the other skeletons uh, can do a double attack as well, and they can blind you, so yay! Hooray for blind! Oh boy. Alright, we'll do a Dragon Blow. Mega Punch. Stun Gun, and... That only cures Poison and Paralyze. That won't do me any good. And... You can just attack then. Go for it. I'm glad we're still hitting despite being blinded. Okay, well that missed. And the person who's not blinded ended up missing. Good good job, Angie. Although I won't be too hard on her. She's not really intent to be a fighter, you know. She's uh she's your healer, you know. Alright, we'll try that again. And you can attack. Try your stun gun again, and you can use recovery. Alright, skeleton one is down. Missed again. Good job. Alright, uh, You know what, you'll probably just miss again, so just attack. Mega Punch, Stun Gun, attack. I like how Wallace is blinded, but yet he hasn't missed a single attack yet. Although I think that's because of the gun. Guns give you good accuracy. She's already blinded, you did nothing. Alright, Dragon... You know what, you're still good with health, so just attack. Mega Punch, uh, standard attack, and we'll get Angel's Kiss back since it ran out. Oh wow, first time we always missed. That's okay, I can't get mad, you, you've been doing good up till now. Oh boy, now we're having trouble hitting. Oh, I was supposed to say he got unblinded, but he just got blinded again before the words could leave my mouth. Damn you skeleton, you beat me to the punch. Good job, Wallace! Oh yeah! We win again! And with that being said, we'll go up here. Ow, ow, ow. Watch out when you're walking through the poison bar. Ah! That was a mean chest. It hurt me. Oh boy. The Skelet Knights! These guys, uh, well, they, you know, use their guns and they do, uh, some scatter shots, which... It's not, it's a normal attack, you know. And I don't want to fight those skeletons again. They took way too long last time. Magic water. Let's go down here. Go around up here. Okay. Uh, you're not worth my time. I'm going to run away. The ghosts in the back aren't that bad. But, uh. The skeletons, as you know, they're a thing. Does... Angie... No, she doesn't yet. I was about to say, if she knows, uh... If she knows her, uh, you know, offensive, uh, white magic... She could do some good damage against these guys, because, they're, you know, they are monsters of the undead, right? What are these things? Oh, they're bats. Well, you know, I have a no-bat policy. Let's get the hell out of here. Alright, I'll go here. Ow, 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 ow. Oh, god, okay. I don't want to fight those guys. So many skeletons. Uh oh, oh. I found a mimic. And um, when I open a chest that's a mimic, I have to fight it. Yeah, that's fine. I'll make it regret trying to eat me. Oh. Oh, that... Man. That hit hard and Wallace is hurting. Uh, I'll heal him. Alright, it's done. I don't have to worry about it too much. 
It is stuck in place and it's not gonna be moving. Dragon Blow, Attack, Stun Gun, and... Heal Wallace again. I love that animation for Dragon Blow. I always just love it, you know, jumping attacks. Alright, you can use uh, Recovery. There you go. And you're gonna need some more uh, MP, so have some magic water. And let's be on our way. Going up here now. And what's down here? A chest. High potion. Good. I need those. Ow, ow, ow. Poison water. And I don't want to fight no skeletons. They take way too long to kill. I mean, I have to stop running away, though, because uh, there is a boss at the end of this place, and he could give me problems, so... I'll yeah, fight these guys, sure. They're just some silly ghosts. Ooh! Wallace, if you keep doing good attacks like that... Man! Captain Wallace is really being the real MVP of this team. Like, ever since we started today, nothing but uh, positivity for Wallace. He did a great, uh, powerful hit that did over 700 points of damage, and despite being blinded, most of his attacks in that first battle hit! Wallace is a badass! Oh, I'm trying to say. <laughs> Alright, I guess I'll fight these guys. I think it's only the R skeletons that can blind. I think these standard ones, uh, can't. I didn't mean to run away, by the way. Shit. <laughs> oh well. There ain't much I can do about it now. I ran away, you know, and I gotta live with that for the rest of my life. Hello, bats. I, you guys on the other end, I really don't want to fight. I have a no bat policy. Because we know how annoying bats are. Even in my own game, they are annoying. Uh, mana up, increase maximum MP. Yes, please. And you can use a recovery spell, heal us all. Nicely done. Andrew is one of my mains in this game, by the way. Because, <laughs> uh, spoiler alert, these four characters are not the only four characters we get in this game. I have, like, a full roster of characters for this game. Oh, I was wrong. Those guys can blind. They just have a very unlikely, uh, chance of doing so. Oh, well, it's just Angie that blinded. it. Not too big a deal. She never really hits that hard anyways. She's mainly intended to be a um, magical healer anyways. But she can get some good wax in. And it's kind of funny that a uh, healer, like, you know, like someone that's supposed to be, like, like pure in soul, is using uh, a stick with a skull on it. <laughs> I mean, it's kind of more holy, I guess, than uh, a blood-soaked mace she was using at the beginning. <laughs> Still, it is kind of funny. <laughs> oh. Oh, we're fighting ghosts and ghouls. That's fine by me. Man, Max, you just keep hitting those good hits, man. You hear me? Haha, <laughs> Brock. Ow. Yeah, sometimes you can block physical attacks. You can't block magic, though. You can reflect magic later if you learn the magical reflect spell. Which I don't think a white mage uh, learns reflect. I think that's a... I think that was from my black mage. Yeah, I'm pretty sure it was. But Angie still has her uses later on. I think I did tell you guys that later on she becomes a very valuable character. Like, healing is not all she does. He's not just a healer. She's a lot more. I mean, she is just a healer right now, but... She's gonna go through a little bit of a transformation. Let me open this. Angel Wing! Now, Angel Wings are like a spirit potions. They revive the dead, but Angel Wings are much better because they revive the dead with half health. Where a spirit potion only brings you back with one health. And I went into this because I wanted to do this and this. Right, that's why I went into the menu in the first place. Nah, I'm not dealing with you. Sorry, but not sorry at the same time. And... 
do. Let's go down here. Watch you through more goop. It's fine. Oh boy. That is a big army against me. And I can't run away. Or rather, I can, but I failed. Oh dear. They're just blinding us. This is not good. There we go. We're getting out of there. That's holy cow. Iron plate. I think that's an Ashley thing. Yes, it is. And now we have another, uh, embroidered wet vest, which I don't have anyone that can equip it. Or, uh, I do, but it's not better than what they already have. High potion. Oh, boy. Alright, I guess I'll fight. Like I said, I do have to stop running away, you know. Also, Max has crazy agility, so he's usually the first character to attack first. Like, every character in this game has their own, you know, strength and weakness. And there's, a uh, 10 characters, so there's that too. Alright, you have 93, 64. You have a low attack. 102, you're definitely, like, the best attack. Alright. I'll give you the Grim Will's uh, belt so you can hit, hit even harder. You can have the Flawless Star. Improve your defenses a little. And you can do a recovery. There we go. And now we can fight some more. Yay! Ghost and Ghouls! I have no problem with this combo. Uh, by the way, guys, um, I may be wrong with this. Like, I don't remember. Like, it's been a long time since I last uh, really touched this game. But I think there's no difference at all between the Ghost and Ghouls. They have the same attacks and I believe the same stats, although I'm, I think I gave the ghouls more health. I can quickly look into that by checking out uh, my Nightmares tab. So I'm gonna do that. Um, let's see, the ghoul. 725 uh, HP. And that's their uh, stats. Now let's check the ghost. Yeah, the ghoul is... Oops. The ghoul has like a little bit uh, more health, but it looks like uh, everything else is exactly the same. And I crashed the game, good! I never had my game crash on me before. Well, I'll see you guys in a bit. Alright guys, welcome back. We are back to where we left off before the game crashed. I apologize for that by the way. I don't know why this game crashed before, because uh... The times I have played this before, like when I was playtesting it and all that stuff, I never had a crash before, and none of the people that playtested it for me have uh, said anything about it crashing, so that was a first for me. Either way, I apologize for that, we're ready to get back into it, and this time I did a lot less of uh, running away, so that's pretty good. And each character did go up one level, so that's also pretty nice, and well, now we get to press on. Press on through this place, I want that chest up there, by the way. Get out of here, you big group. Those guys I still run away from because that is a big bunch of, mo of monsters. Big bunch of monsters, a big army of monsters. My god, what the heck? What the hell is my brain thinking there? Oh, why did I want this again? That was just a trap. Why did I want that again? I don't know. Either way, I fell for an art trap. So, yay, I guess. <laughs> I don't know. Nah, I don't want to deal with no bats. I have a no bat policy, as you guys know. They're kind of not fun. Alright, so we're on the top floor now. Uh, we could go down that way if we want, which is the way we have to go. But there is a big door that way, so if you go down that way, you're going to have to backtrack anyway to find uh, the key. Which uh, I believe the key is up there, so we have to find a way up there. And what was that I found? I think it said Adventurer's uh, Vest, right? Yeah, Adventurer's Vest. I do want to put that on. Not on you. On you. There we go. And run away from the skeletons, because they just blind us, and that would take forever. Hey, we found our save point. We're near the end of this place, by the way. I don't know if I mentioned that, but yeah, we are. Uh, I'll give you some more defense. Because why the hell not? Power up. Okay, who, got, who needs more power? I think uh, Max does, actually. <laughs> That's why I gave him the Grim Wheel armlet. So he could hit harder. Hello, ghosties! Please go away, I do not wish to deal with you. I 
don't wish to deal with you or your 700 HP. There we go. And we learned the buff. Which that's pretty cool. So if I fight an enemy that increases their stats, I can debuff it and turn it back to normal. Ah, uh, Max, you missed the first strike. It's better when you get the double combo though. Ooh, ouch. Okay, you're not messing around. I can't mess around either then. We're gonna focus my power. And we use a stun gun. And you can use a potion. Alright, attack is up. Next turn's gonna hurt this thing. Alright, there we go. Dragon blow. Mega punch. You can attack. And you need some more MP, I guess, so you just take a magic water. I was expecting you to do more damage, Max. Ow! Holy jeez! Okay, can you guys uh, please start hitting, just saying? Like, that would be fantastic if that's something you could start doing, just saying. There we go! Alright, first thing I'm gonna do without hesitating at all is uh, heal her up. Because Ashley needs to stay alive. She is the main hero of the story, after all. Without her, there's no one to use the Dream Binder, and if there's no one can use the Dream Binder, then the world is screwed. Well, actually, that's not entirely true. If she's not alive, the Dream Binder would find a new master, which would be the person that's watching our adventures through their dreams. Um. I never really thought about who that would be because it was kind of irrelevant to the story because Ashley is the one that ended Nightmares after all, so it really wasn't important to know who was watching her, right? But that's something I guess I could have looked into. Maybe it's something I will do if I decide to do a sequel or maybe a prequel. Like, maybe you'd like to play Claudius Adventure, right? That's something I could do. Because as you can see, Claudius had his own adventure. He knew Angie because uh, Angie referred to him as a friend when he met her. So yeah, let me get, let me know about that, you guys. Uh, yes or no to a prequel of uh, uh, The Legend of the Dream Binder. I don't really think there's really any room for like a sequel because, well, you'll see when we get to the end. Alright, let's get these skeleton guys out of here. Alright, we did that. That's pretty awesome. And now open this. I got Swift Blade. I already have a Swift Blade. You know what? I'm gonna put it on because I hit harder with it. I was kind of having fun with the stun gun, but... Yeah, let's put that back on so I can, you know, use a... Uh... So I can use, you know, weapon break and armor break. Armor break would be a good idea. Why did I run away from those ghosts? I don't know. Resist up. What's that do? Increases magic defense. Um, let me look at my stats to see who could use it the most. You have 61. 23, yikes. 26, okay. And 23, oh boy. I think I'll give it to Ashley. There we go. Hello, ghosties. Yeah, Wallace hits a lot harder using a sword. Oh no, that is the intent. Like, uh, the gun gives you, like, different abilities as well as faster attacks. But it does kind of offer, uh, defense because you can't use a shield and a gun at the same time. Where the sword hits harder, but... You know, it lacks in other areas like speed. So, kind of what you value more. Um, attacking... Like attacking harder or more speed. Or actually, it's not speed with the gun, it's accuracy. Sorry about that. <laughs> but yeah, which of those do you value more is kind of what it comes down to with Lois. I kept prefer using power, so I'll probably stick with a sword. Alright, we gotta fight this thing. As we know, there's no running away from a mimic. If the mimic, if you have awakened a mimic, you must fight it. Damn! Max hitting hard! Oh god, the mirror came back hard too. 
And now Max is blinded. It doesn't matter, we win. And Ashley is leveled up, and so has Max. Cool. Alright, we need you. Heal him. And we'll press on now. And there's something up here. The magic water. Cool. And run away from these guys. I don't want to fight them. They're not worth my time. And plus they would take too long to kill anyways because they're a huge army. I said they're not worth my time. Stop giving me those guys. Uh, bats, as you know, I also have no bad policy. And yeah, if you didn't go the other way to get the key, you might be hating yourself right now because you'll have to backtrack and open it to open this. And yeah, I want to save. And there's our recovery, which is a good idea because up here is a boss. There's a little ghost uh, soldier here. I want to fight him at full health. Do you really mind, game? It's really, do you mind? That's really something I want to do. You had to give me one encounter before I get to the boss? Eh, uh, eh, they didn't do too much damage, so I guess it's fine. Hello? Tell me, Samurai. What brings you to these forsaken lands? We are on a quest to revive the Dreambinder. How do you know about the Dreambinder? I told her. She was the new chosen master, so she must know what it is and what her quest is. I don't believe you! Leave! Uh, I think we got a fight on our hands, lad and lasses. I guess we have no other choice. Yeah, we gotta fight this uh, fallen hero. He doesn't really have a reason to be uh, kind of a dick, does he? But Okay, we'll fight him. I mean, he has a little bit of a reason, which will be explained a little bit later after we defeat. Oh, jeez. Well, this guy hits hard. Okay, Dragon Heart, Mega Punch, Weapon Break, and go for recovery. Shit! You couldn't have waited to do that, huh? Alright. Uh, you can use our Dragon Blow. You can use our, the, our only Angel Wing, and... Use an Attack Break to lower his attack power some more. Welcome back. Alright, we're just gonna have to keep wickening it using our bowis. Oh, I missed. I had a bad feeling about that. We'll try again. And you can attack. And this time we'll do an armor break to lower your defenses a little bit. Alright, now he's doing some okay damage. And yeah, he needs his defense weakened. Max can't even phase him. There we go. Now, Dragon Blow is a great attack because it bypasses defense, so you'll be doing good damage regardless. But, as you can see, it doesn't have the best accuracy and there's, uh, some possibility you won't hit, you know. Uh, sure, I'll use that. Anything to help out my whole party? Focusing power. Say your prayers. I missed again. Alright, you can attack, you can use Mega Punch, you can attack, and recovery! There we go, nice! Now I think I should use um, the Angel's Kiss attack. You know, just so that, uh, just so that I have an auto recovery that will heal me like every turn. Don't you dare kill us. Oh boy. I think I had to use a uh, weapon break again. Because it looks like his uh, attack power has returned. Alright, there we go. And Dragon Tar, attack, attack, and recovery. And our stuff are dropping because uh, the three turns for that have expired. Alright, here we go. Dragon Blow, Mega Punch, and Standard Attack. And we'll use our Divine Breath, breath again. Ah! Ow! Ow! Damn it. 
Max has died again. Alright. We can start off with you bringing Max back. You use Weapon Break because holy Jesus Christ. And you can use a potion on Max. There we go. And everyone cooperated and did stuff in the right order. Then that makes me very happy. Alright, focus. And you can use a potion and you can use Angel's Kiss. Yeah. Oh god, he's hitting way too hard for my liking. Alright, uh, make a punch. Weapon break. Recovery! Alright, attack goes down, our defense dropped though, because it's already been three turns, alright, wow. Haha, -ha, you missed! You too slow, and I too fast. Alright, dragon blow, mega punch, uh, weapon break again, and you can use some magic water, because you need some MP. Alright, there we go. Lowering your attack. Good job with that. Alright. And uh, you can focus again to get your power back up. And now we'll start using an armor break. And you can just attack this turn. I don't have much else use for you right now, Angie. I know your attack probably won't do anything anyways. Ah! Yeah, I took no damage. I knew it. Alright. That's fine. Dragon Blow. Mega Punch. Uh, armor break and standard attack. Ow! Eh, that wasn't too bad actually. What am I owing about? How much health do you have? Yeah, we'll do weapon break because uh, that would be a problem if that pops up, you know? Angel's kiss. Oh crap. Okay, he hit wall was kind of hard. I don't know if his attack re Oh yeah, I did return to I just saw the message at the top of the screen. Man, Ashley is having real problems. Like a real world of problems hitting the guy. Uh, break. And just attack. Oh! Hey, we did it! The fallen hero is defeated. He has fallen a second time. We learned here too. Great! 10,000 years later, since the day I died, I protected these forsaken lands, just to perish. Please let me explain what's going on. Ashley is a new Dream Samurai. As the Chosen One, it's her duty to restore the Dream Binder. It's okay, I believed you. I just needed to test your strength. Plus, I really wanted to finally pass on to the afterlife. I'll tell you what I know quickly before I go. Below me is a teleporter to the basement of these ruins. Down there, you'll find a little canoe. That canoe can't go into deep water, but it can reach the boathouse. Go there and take a ship to the east. There, you'll find a Dracano. Good luck, Miss Chosen One. Thank you, Fallen Hero. I think we can trust him, Ashley. That should take us to the basement, like he said. Okie dokie! Into the basement we go! And this is our restore all. Pretty cool. Thank you. And there's the canoe. And now we can just uh, swim on out of here. And welcome back to the world, man! And that's the boat house we have to go to, but before I go there, I'm going back to Bradford. Oh, then we got a fight. Okay, well, that's fine. We got some scorpions to take care of. No big deal. And that's how we get things done around here. Alright, back in Bradford. I don't need to heal, really. No, I don't. So, I'm just gonna go up here and use a save point. And before I end this episode, I'm gonna go to the shops and I am going to... Buy and sell a few things. First, I will sell the stuff I'm not using anymore. I'll keep the shelter in case I want to switch to a gun though. 
just I have no plans, but you know, anything is possible, right? And now let's buy some high potions, because regular potions won't do me much good anymore. And some magic water, some spirit potions, and some antidotes. And that'll be all. Have a nice day. Alright guys, I'm going back to the save point to end this episode, so while I am doing this, thank you guys so much for joining me and coming to the Legend of the Dream Binder. I really hope you guys are enjoying this, and I'll see you guys next time. Thank you for joining me. Have a nice day. Bye everybody.